What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's time to talk about what's going on with Shiba Inu coin. And there's some new information about Shibarium just released recently that I want to highlight in this video and talk about what we can expect for the future of SHIB and where we could be heading next. Now, Lucy has given us some information regarding that. We are going to talk about that in this video and uh, break down what I think should be kind of some things to watch as we roll out new things with Shibarium as this uh, bull run progresses. Now, with the price of Bitcoin, we saw Bitcoin go down 41,500, all the way down to 41,500. We're back up over 43. A lot of volatility right now with Bitcoin and uh, altcoins starting to tick back up. If we take a look at where SHIB is right now, we're ranked number 17, just outside uh, right now that, uh, you know, 4010 level. We're climbing closer to that. We did dial back uh, below those levels here in the last 24 hours. And you can see in the last seven days, we had a nice little pop here two days ago, back up into the 10 range. But uh, since then, we have just kind of hovered there and a little bit below. Uh, now, I wanna dive into this because this is the kind of the main focal point here. Uh, Shiba Inu, Shibarium's future unveiled by SHIB marketing lead. Now, you guys know Lucy has taken over the reins there uh, with Shibarium and Shiba Inu's official marketing expert who prefers to call herself Lucy on social media has published recently something on Binance Square Network to address the SHIB community and unfold what awaits the L2 Shibarium Network this year soon. While talking about that, Lucy also emphasized the great importance of the role that the Shiba Inu army has to play as Shibarium continues to expand. Now, I get all that, right? Because Shibarium is only going to go as far as people use it, right? There needs to be uh, people using the network in order for this thing to actually work. I get all of that. However, what are the incentives, right? We want to burn a lot of SHIB as community members. That's one thing that we want. So we need to see that the team is going to burn when they say they're going to burn. More people are going to use Shibarium if they can actually see the burns trans uh, and transparent uh, transparency is there and they can actually see the burns happen. Right now, we've got a ton of stuff sitting there that should be burned. It's not yet been burned. We're supposed to get automated burns sometime this month. We don't have a lot of information on that. So that's not a huge incentive right now for people to actually use Shibarium. So if we want community members to actually use it, we need to know exactly how this money is going to help burn Shiba Inu, right? And we're not seeing that. We're not seeing that completely. Now, there's more than that, right? But burning is a big deal. That has been made abundantly clear. All you have to do is ask around the community, look in comment sections, look around, right? Why do people shut off the comments and stuff? Why are there so many more haters now than there were before? It's the lack of transparency, okay? And I want the best for the SHIB army, but that is something that needs to shift and change. Uh, she did talk about, Lucy did, the future of the Shibarian blockchain, elaborating that it'll go far beyond Shiba Swap and Shiba Eternity, which is their play to earn game. Of course, we knew this. There's, you know, this whole push to be uh, creating a basically decentralized economy, okay? And they want to build what's called, what they're calling the super app. Shiba Hub and the long-awaited SHIB metaverse as well. That's going to be huge to watch, this metaverse. And just how many things can be integrated in here. Uh, I think the gaming side is certainly something that needs to be looked at as a place to really grow out this ecosystem. I think there's a ton of potential there. Lucy also mentioned that new projects are eagerly joining the Shibarium ecosystem, which is good. New dApps, new focal points, aside from these projects who have, quote, grand plans. Whispers in the crypto realm suggest more exciting launches are imminent. Uh, Lucy stressed that while a realm of Shibarium is surrounded by Shiba Eternity game, Shib the Metaverse and Shiba Swap decks, still the, quote, true excitement lies in the mysteries yet to be unraveled. And that's great. We can have some things that we're still awaiting that we don't know about. But when it comes to burns, when you say you're going to do something, do it on the dates. Actually deliver on that, right? Uh, a perfect future for Shibarium per Lucy lies with a perfect and robust community inspiring thousands of new projects to build on Shibarium. Agree 100%. And I'm excited about where we're heading. Uh, transaction volume has plunged recently uh, after dropping a four-week low to, to a four-week low of 2.46 million transactions per day. This metric has dropped even lower now, uh, sitting at 1.33 million. Still pretty solid overall, but we were hovering there at 6-7 million daily transactions for a while. We'll keep an eye on that as well. So let me know what you guys think about this down below. Don't forget to comment your thoughts. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Also, if you guys are interested in checking out Margex for trading, uh, those links are down below. Trade up to 100x leverage. 
Sign up with Margex today. You get a $50 bonus to pay trading fees. Deposit $100 to get an additional $50 bonus using my link only down below in the comment section. And then, of course, XTAlgo, if you're looking to utilize a trading indicator, I've got links down there for our indicator as well. Uh, you guys know uh, just how awesome this thing has been for so many people uh, here and uh, can be used for crypto and stocks. So those links down below in the comment section. Shib Army, appreciate you guys for checking this video out. Let me know what you think down below. We'll see you in the next one.